Xerox Work Center 6027 Scan to PC Desktop Folder. The documentation for setting up Scan to PC Desktop Folder are located in the User Guide. To find the User Guide, start at Xerox.com. Do a search for Work Center 6027 documentation. The first link you'll see is for the product documentation for the Work Center 6027. Click on the link to open the documentation. All of the user documentation is available in PDF format. The one you'll need is the user guide. Click on it to open it. In section 3 of the table of contents is setting up scanning. The section you will need is on page 78. Setting up scanning to a shared folder on your computer. For this example, we will be setting up Scan to PC folder on a Windows 10 PC. Similar instructions are included in the user guide for Apple iOS. To get started, you will need to gather and record network IP addresses for both your Work Center 6027 printer and your PC. These will be recorded to be used later in the process. You will need to find the IP address of your printer. To do this, at the control panel, press Machine Status. Touch the information pages. Touch configuration, then touch print. The machine will print a configuration page. IPv4 and IPv6 information is located in the network setup section of the configuration page. Record the IP address as it will be used later in the process. Use the search window in the lower left corner and type CMD. Click on the command prompt to open the command window. This can also be done from your Windows PC keyboard by pressing and holding the Windows key while pressing the R key. A dialog box will open and then type CMD and click OK. In the CMD window, at the blinking cursor, type ipconfig and press Enter. Locate and record the IPv4 address of your computer. Close the CMD window. From your PC, you'll need to set up a shared folder, which is where the scanned output will reside. Create a folder on your desktop and name it. Right-click the folder you want to share, then select Properties. Click the Sharing tab, and then click Advanced Sharing. Select Share this folder. Click Permissions. Select the Everyone group, and verify that all permissions are enabled. Click Apply. Click OK. Click Apply. Click OK again. Then click Close. Next we will add a folder as an address book entry using the embedded web page on your device. This will require the IP address of your Work Center 6027. At your computer, open a web browser. In the address field, type the IP address of your printer. Then click Return or Enter. Click Address Book. Under Network Scan, click Computer slash Server Address Book. Click Add next to any empty field and enter the following information. In the Name field, enter the name that you want to appear in the Address Book. Server type. Ensure SMB is selected from the pull-down menu. Host address. Enter the IP address of your computer. Port number. Enter the default port number for SMB, 139, or select a number from the range provided. Login name. Enter your computer's login name. Login password. Enter your computer's login password. Re-enter the password. Name of shared directory. Enter the name of the shared folder which was set up earlier. Click Save Changes. If no errors were recorded, close your browser. 
Verify that the settings for SMB scanning are correct by performing a test scan at the machine. Load the originals on the document glass or in the document handler. Press the Scan to, then touch Network. Select the name of the folder in the address book list. Press the green Start button. Your scanned image should be in your shared folder on your computer.